all heard of the benefits of pomegranates, and now, thanks to a winery in Madeira, you can enjoy those same benefits in a glass of wine. We are talking, yes, folks, about pomegranate wine. Here with more are the owners of Twin Pomegranates Wine, Nick and Brian Davis. Welcome, both of you, to the show, guys. It's Thank good you. to have you. Okay, you Thank are you. twins. Let's just get that right off the bat, right? You're twins. Yes. Okay, beautiful. Uh, when did you start this, this, this wine company? This is really interesting. Well, this idea started a couple years ago. Mm -hmm. My brother and I are Cal Poly graduates. Mm -hmm. I got a degree in enology, winemaking, and his degree is in marketing. And uh, we are farmers from Madeira, and we farm pomegranates. And we thought we'd come up with this crazy idea and make a wine out of pomegranates. Is, is it though, Brian, really, is it a wine? When yeah. you drink it, it, how much alcohol content does yeah. it have? Well, actually, our wine is about 12.5% alcohol. Okay, that's it's pretty good. It's 100% pomegranate, so there's zero grape juice in there whatsoever. We wanted something that was going to carry on the characteristics of the pomegranate and have mm -hmm. all those taste, flavors, aromas of pomegranate. So, yes, it's 100% pomegranate. 100 so I'm assuming wine. that it's not a sweet wine because pomegranates really aren't all that sweet, are they? Yeah, you know, they, they are sweet, but they just don't, aren't as sweet as grapes. Okay. Um, our pomegranate wine is not typically a dessert style wine. Most okay. dessert style wines are between 10 to 12 percent residual sugar, really heavy, really tasty, but really heavy. Ours is 3 percent residual sugar, so it's on the lighter side. Okay. That really complements the acid in pomegranates. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it makes a great summer drink, I imagine. Yeah, phenomenal, okay. phenomenal. I, does it have to be chilled? Yes. Yeah, we serve it chilled, but uh, we have a lot of people that tell us that they like it warm. They have a couple different recipes they make with it, too. It's kind of a, a more versatile wine. But yeah, we serve it chilled, but you can drink it different ways. And does it really have all the health benefits that pomegranates do? You know, we did. You know how they have they have antioxidants and all that. That's correct. You know, we did measure that because we had a lot of questions. A lot of consumers would ask, well, "Does it have the antioxidants in it?" And this and that. So we wanted to be 100% sure that we are do know what we're talking about. We did measure them. We did lose a little bit through the fermentation process, but the majority of of, of what's in pomegranates is in pomegranate wine. But I mean, seriously, if you're drinking wine, are you really thinking about? Huh? getting your <laughs> you'd, be you'd be surprised how many people see us at events that we go to uh -huh. and one of the things that are on their mind is uh, is that pomegranate still in the wine is it still there <laughs> should I be interested and we just kind of say well first of all it's a wine have fun with it it's yeah. supposed to be a fun thing it's uh -huh. supposed to be yeah. something different but have fun we just want to kill two birds with one that's stone. right that's, that's right all right um, this is so interesting how long did it take from the concept from when you first came up with the idea to now having it bottled like you do. I mean, that's pretty amazing. A long time. I mean, uh, <laughs> about twice or three times as long as we thought it was really going to take. Oh. There's a lot of paperwork involved, uh, scheduling, uh, design work, promotions, um, point of sales material, actually getting into stores. But it actually took us approximately uh, maybe a two, two and a half years or so yeah. to really get going. Wow. No wonder yeah. you're so excited about yeah, it. We're, we're excited <laughs> for you. We <laughs> really are, it. especially because it's in a lot of stores. You mentioned it, and let's talk about that, Brian. You're, since November, th the wine is in Save Mart, Vons. I, I, seriously? Yep. Wow. Yep. Uh, Save Mart went out on a limb with us, and uh, they took us on. Mm -hmm. And so since November, we've been in about 25 to 30 Save Marts going on that. We're in Vons now. Vons just picked us up, so that's really exciting. We're in a few different wine shops here around town in Fresno. We've got some wine in Monterey. We have some in San Diego, in Ventura. So everybody that starts hearing about it thinks it's pretty novel, tastes it, likes it, and brings it in. So it, we're, we're really excited about Is that. Is there a way to taste it first and then buy Because a lot of people may not want to buy a whole bottle. And are, are, Do you guys go to certain events where people can taste the wine? We do a lot of events in the area, okay. as many events as we possibly can. Okay. We've done, I would say, 15 events in the last uh, six to eight months. Uh, we, you can find us if you go to Appalachian, California. Okay. It's on Avenue 7 and 99 okay. on your way to Madera or into Fresno. And you can taste it there if you like. That's a good place to try it. Or you can try a bottle and split it with friends and share the happiness. Do you have a wine club? We do have a wine club. Please, you can visit uh, TwinPalms.com, okay. and you can sign up for our wine club there. Okay. So, and then, and then you could also get the wine at Save Mart and all yep. those places. Now, yes. are we talking more of a high-end kind of wine where it's going to cost a little bit more than? No, not necessarily. Okay. I think uh, you know it's a tough time right now. Everybody knows, and a lot of great wines have been uh, going down in price to meet the economy. Mm -hmm. Our wines are actually priced at about ten dollars a bottle. Nice. So, I think for a very reasonable price, you can get that new flavor and uh, still 
enjoy something a little different. Yes, for sure, and very unique mm -hmm. and tasty. All right, next time you two come on, <laughs> can we please open up a bottle so I can taste it? Absolutely, yeah. I think that's and a, a must. And I'll be honest with everybody. That's okay, right. It is a must. Okay, thank you, you so much. And don't forget, you can visit twinpalms.com or you can call uh, 674-9439. There it is. Pretty bottle, too. I love it. Thank you. All right, good going, guys. Thank you so much for being here. Thanks we for having appreciate us. It. Appreciate it. Stick around, folks. Central Valley Today will be right back. Thank you.